What's up, the John Squad? This is John Pilling here, and this is your YouTube World Heritage Champion here on YouTube. I'm coming to you to my WWE Monday Night Raw review for January 6, 2020. That is with the John Squad, so let's do this. Shout out to the John Squad. So, we kicked out the Monday Night Raw last night with Paul Heyman and Brock Lesnar, and Paul Heyman talks about the new decade and talks about that Brock Lesnar's making history and and that and he and how he's making history is that that Brock Lesnar is going to be in the Royal Rumble as the WWE champion and is going to be entered as number one, and it's going to be like a dream match where he's going to compete against ever 29 other superstars, and that's how it's going to be making history where he's going to be entering first, and that he is going to win the WWE Royal Rumble. So that's what Paul Heyman says, and that's not a prediction. It's a spoiler. So that's what he tells everybody, and that's why he said he's going to win. So the first match we had Raw was a United States Championship match we had, we had was Rey Mysterio versus Andrade, and Rey Mysterio won, but then they had to restart the match because Selena Vega put Andrade's foot on the rope, but the winner of this match was and still our United States Champion was Andrade. Then the second match we had on Raw was a Raw Tag Team Championship match we had was the Street Profits versus the Viking Raiders versus the OC, Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. And the winner of that match was, and still our Raw Tag Team Champions, was the Viking Raiders. So then the third match we had on Raw was Eric Rowan versus a local competitor, and the winner was Eric Rowan. Eric Rowan, man, when's he gonna fight, you know, new new people like him? Like, not local bears, like, no names like that. Like, when's he gonna fight, like, real talent, you know? Get real tired of that. But then, the next match around Raw was AJ Styles versus Akira Tozawa, and the winner was AJ Styles. Then we had a Bobby Lashley and Lana, and then they had to re redo their wedding because last week it got ruined. In Lana and Lashley get married, and they redo it, and Lana is not happy, and and she talks about Rusev, and Lashley talks about Rusev, and Rusev appears on the Tron, on the Dumbo, on the Titan Tron, and and. And talks about that he's bringing back the Bulgarian brute next week, and that next week he's bringing back the Bulgarian brute R R Rusev to be facing Bobby Lashley in a match, and it is set and official. Next week we're gonna have Rusev versus Bobby Lashley. The fifth match we were gonna have on Raw was Charlotte Flair versus Sarah Logan, but this match never happens at all because Sarah Logan just destroys Charlotte Flair and beats her up and then because them two kept brawling it out and having a brawl and Charlotte Flair stands tall after this brawl. So another match we had on Raw was Drew McIntyre versus No way. Jose, no way. Jose, and the winner of this match was Drew McIntyre. And then another match in the row was Aleister Black versus Shelton Benjamin. And the winner of this match was Aleister Black. After the match is over, Buddy Murphy comes out and attacks Aleister Black. And next week we're getting Aleister Black versus Buddy Murphy, how many times is this? Three times? Three times they're facing each other? I don't know, but... Anyway, on to the next one. So then, the main that we had on Raw was AOP and Seth Rollins, who's going by Monday Night Asylum. That's what Seth Rollins is going by now, as his nickname. Versus Kevin Owens, Samoa Joe, and they picked a mystery tag team partner. And it is was to reveal as the Big Show. The Big Show is now back, and 
The winner was Kevin Owens, the Big Show, and Samoa Joe due to Seth Rollins coming to the ring and hitting the Big Show with the steel chair after the match was over. AOP is be be beaten up on Samoa Joe. Then K Kevin Owens saves Big Show from getting a curb stomp. From saves the Big Show from getting curb stomp from Seth Rollins. Then next thing you know it is that Seth Rollins gets a gets the knockout punch from the Big Show and that's what happens to Undeadly Monday Night Raw with the good guy standing tall. Kevin Owens, Samoa Joe, and the Big Show. And that's what happens to Diddy Monday Night Raw last night with Seth Rollins all days on top of the ramp. And that's what happens to him. Diddy Monday Night Raw last night. So, once again, the John Squad, please like this video. Leave your comments down below. And subscribe for more. You're all the best, John Squad. You're all one of a kind. I love each and every single one of you all. You mean a lot to me. And I love each and every single one of you. So don't forget to please like this video, leave your comments down below, subscribe for more, tap that bell on YouTube so you don't miss out on my videos so you get notifications when I upload my videos, and subscribe for more. Peace out, the John Squad. Love you guys.